Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Bailey and I make college and lifestyle type videos. But for today's video, I thought it would be fun to film my first time trying HelloFresh. So a lot of you who watch YouTube a lot probably know what HelloFresh is. It is a meal kit delivery service. By no way is it sponsored by HelloFresh whatsoever, but I finally decided to cave and order HelloFresh and try it out for myself because a lot of the YouTube community that I follow, such as like Aspen Ovar, Aldegar, Alex Garza, people like that. A lot of the people in the YouTube community that I watch, such as Aspen Ovard and Alex Garza, all are sponsored by HelloFresh. I know that like in their videos they do say the meals are good and whatnot, but technically they are being paid to promote HelloFresh. I don't believe they would promote it if they didn't really love it, but I personally want to try it out for myself because there are so many influencers promoting HelloFresh these days. Also, YouTuber Bianca Franco also really enjoys HelloFresh. She is not sponsored by them, but she does continually order from them. So I thought it would be really cool to go ahead and film me trying HelloFresh for you guys. I wasn't going to like film me trying it, but then I was like, that might would be a good video idea. I can kind of give an all like non-biased, honest review of HelloFresh if I think it's worth it. For many of you who don't really know what it is, you get four meals, I think or like a week worth of meals and you could pick like a family plan or an individual individual plan so I have the plan for two and then it brings all your ingredients and it's for a certain price so I think each box is like $70 maybe I think that's what my mom paid my mom got it for me or whatnot so if you hear also crunching in the background Indy is eating her dog food right now so it's kind of rude Indy to eat your dog food while I'm filming but whatever ignore that but I thought it would be really cool to try it out and in my opinion grocery shopping gets so expensive because you have to buy everything like in the package it comes in so if you only need like two sprigs of parsley you have to buy a whole entire thing of parsley and then you end up throwing it all away. So it's very wasteful so I think the idea of HelloFresh and getting as much as you need for that one meal and not having any leftovers is a really great concept and idea especially for someone like me who's in college and I really don't enjoy eating our calf. So I really wanted to try out HelloFresh and see if this is something that I want to continue in the future and maybe help some of you girls who especially are in college and it's kind of hard to you know get to the grocery store every time this is delivered to your door. I think it's very convenient but hopefully the food matches like I guess everything else that you get. So it sounds really awesome but I hope the food is as good as they make it out to be as well. So that is what this video is going to be. Me giving you my honest and unbiased opinion of HelloFresh. So if you like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up as well as hit the subscribe button down below and stay tuned for me cooking my first HelloFresh meal ever. So like I was saying before all the HelloFresh meals come in this box and they are delivered right to your door. The box is also like insulated. It has um, like ice coolers and stuff in it so if you're not home by the time your delivery arrives the meat and stuff in it is not going to be bad. So that is really awesome and something to consider when you're ordering HelloFresh, I love the convenience of your groceries technically being delivered right to your door. So this is the box that comes in and then in the fridge I have the meal I am going to be making tonight. It's down here. Where's the chicken? Okay. So tonight I'm going to be making the chicken carnitas tacos. So this is the bag that all the ingredients are in and then it gives you your meat pre-packaged and the exact amount you're going to need. So this is what I'm going to be making today also in my quote what you would call I guess pantry area. I have the meal kit thing. Okay. So each HelloFresh meal also comes with a little picture guide and it tells you everything you need to know and every step you need to take in order to prepare the meal so that is really really easy so you know exactly what to do step by step so this is what I am making tonight so I'm going to go ahead and get all the ingredients out and I'll show you guys that okay so I just laid out all the ingredients that I need so I've got chicken a bunch of different pre-packaged like seasonings and sauces that you'll need like a whole can of tomato paste like would be a lot more than this but they give you exactly what you need which helps prevent waste and a tomato, a red onion, a lime, and a green bell pepper. This is a thing of onion. Maybe? Yeah, scallions. Scallions, that's a scallion. And then white wine vinegar, the exact amount that you would need, which is so convenient. And then flour tortillas. So this is all the ingredients that I'm going to need. So now I'm going to start preparing my meal. And let's see how easy this can be. Okay, so step one says to prep and wash all wash and dry all the produce. So that is what I'm going to do right now.
Okay, so I cut up, I guess you could say, all my vegetables and whatnot. So that is done. And step two says to pickle the onion, and then that is what I'm going to do next. And then step three is cook the chicken. So I'm going to do those two steps, and then I will come back. Okay guys, so I have done a couple more steps after I have updated you. So I've got the, what is this called? The crema ready. So that's the like sour cream crema. The veggies are cooking. My chicken is done. I'm going to add that back in there after I add a couple more things. So right now I am on step five. And I've got this over here. So we're getting somewhere. It's definitely a lot at once. It's kind of hard to film while doing it since I'm trying to you know, film it, document it, and whatnot. But if you're kind of more focused on just the cooking aspect, you're a little bit probably better off. But this is what we've got to work with now. It's definitely easy to the directions to follow. So I'll update you guys in a minute. Okay, guys, I am done with everything. I've got my my tortillas, the pico de gallo salsa you make, the crema that you make, as well as the chicken and vegetable mix. The only thing I did not do that the recipe does say to do is to pickle some onion use the white vinegar over there to pickle the onion. I'm not a huge fan of onions, so I just went ahead and disregarded the rest of my onion. I did put like onion in there, but I just didn't want a ton of onion because it's just not my favorite. So I am going to plate this and then I will catch up with you guys when I get done with that. Okay guys, so this is the final product. It looks really good. So lastly, I'm just going to grab the slice of lime I had left over, put a little bit of lime juice on the tacos. So that's done. So now I am going to enjoy. It is 6.30. I started around 6. It took me about 30 minutes. So now I'm going to give these guys a taste test. Okay, guys. Sorry if this isn't the best angle, but I just wanted to kind of get, I guess, my first reaction trying the tacos on camera. It's a little weird eating on camera but I thought it would kind of be fun so I am going to try the tacos for the first time so let's see how they taste very good wow pretty spicy not gonna lie my eyes are about water I think it's the chili seasoning in the crema I'm going to finish my food because I don't want it to get cold and then I will jump back on here and kind of give you all, I guess, my final review slash opinion of HelloFresh. So I'll get back to you in a minute. Okay guys, I am back for my little sit down and final review of HelloFresh. Once again, if you hear any random noise that is indie down there below playing, being very obnoxiously loud right now. But overall, I really did enjoy the tacos. They were pretty good. They were a little too spicy. Like, I mean, I ate them, but they were very spicy. But the recipe does warn you that. So I definitely had to drink a lot of water because boy, it was my mouth on fire. I also ended up did it. I also ended up not eating everything just because it was just me. The plan is technically for two people because you can't really choose just a one person plan. So I did have leftovers and whatnot. So that is good, I guess, too, if you're in college and, you know, you make a meal for dinner and then you can eat it for lunch or dinner the next day as well. So you kind of get two meals in one. So that was something that I really enjoyed. The only thing that I have to say that I would think would be a negative for HelloFresh and something that I would not like is when you go to like get your meals you can pick certain meals but you never know if you're gonna like everything just like when you go to a restaurant you're never gonna know if you're gonna love what you order unless like you get like steak and mashed potatoes and who doesn't love that but you're never really gonna know if you like the recipe that they send you like I know um one recipe one that my mom kept we kind of split the box but one that she kept had like peas and stuff in it and it didn't really look that great like it definitely wouldn't have been my choice so every now and then you probably are gonna get a recipe that you really don't prefer so that is kind of a con with HelloFresh but overall I personally think it's kind of worth your money especially if you're on the go and really don't have time to go to the grocery store or cook a really long meal I know it personally took around 30 minutes for me to cook this entire meal so it definitely wasn't that bad 
I'll say the one thing that I hate more than anything about cooking is the cleanup. I feel like you slave to make this food, you eat it, and then you have to like clean up. I mean, obviously, if you're married and you can kind of change roles, someone can do that for you. But now I have to go back after sitting down with you and giving you guys my final review and clean up all my mess. But HelloFresh does make it pretty easy to kind of know how much dishes you're going to have to have like throughout the recipe. If you read it beforehand, there's basically like you need two bowls to mix this and this so personally overall I didn't really have that many dishes to do which I love because I hate doing dishes so so much and Indy you are being so so loud overall I would definitely give HelloFresh around probably like a 8.5 out of 10 I did really enjoy the tacos don't get me wrong they weren't my favorite tacos I've ever had and there she goes again but if you know me you know I've had a lot of tacos in my lifetime I literally eat a taco like tacos once a week like we have a taco night here we get I go every single week tomorrow's the night and I love those tacos I don't think a taco is ever going to beat that taco so obviously I put this like recipe up against a lot of contenders because I eat tacos more than anything because that's my favorite food she's being so obnoxious I'm sorry it definitely was good though for an at-home taco that you yourself made so I really enjoyed the recipe that I had next I have another recipe that I'm going to make later in the week sadly that I won't be videoing for you guys but it's parmesan crusted chicken with pasta and I'm very excited for that one because you can't like Parmesan, Parmesan crusted chicken is always good. So I'm very excited for that. But overall, I had a really good experience with HelloFresh. I would definitely recommend it to people that are really looking to try it and are really on the go and stuff. This is very convenient for college people, like people with small children and whatnot. Like I really enjoy it. I think I would definitely be ordering from HelloFresh in the future. It's convenient. Honestly, since I don't personally like go out and buy a bunch of gro groceries for like me and my husband or I don't have a husband but like me and my boyfriend or my mom how she goes and buys groceries for the whole family I can't really look at the whole money factor like if I'm saving money or not because for me like I don't really go and buy groceries for a bunch of people so yes it is very expensive like if I wanted to make those tacos by myself and not through HelloFresh I would definitely have to buy a lot more ingredients and I would waste a lot more and have a lot more leftovers don't get me wrong what are you doing can you get down come on Indy come come here come here get down <laughs> but as far as like the saving money asset I feel like you really do save money especially um you know when you go to the grocery store I feel like you get so much unnecessary stuff that you never end up using and it goes bad in your fridge and you end up having to throw it away so that is a very convenient part of it but overall like I said I enjoy HelloFresh and I definitely will probably be trying out more of their meals in the future I hope you guys found this video pretty helpful in that if you're interested or kind of on the fence about trying HelloFresh that you'll at least give it a try. I know there's a ton of YouTubers like I mentioned before that have discount codes that you can use towards HelloFresh so if you're really interested in it I suggest kind of looking through some of those videos and seeing if you can find a discount code to use but I really enjoyed making this video for you guys as well. Just make sure if you enjoyed it to give it a thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below as well as follow me here on my other social medias. I post there a lot more frequently than I post on YouTube but I really Really enjoyed making this video for you guys and I hope you guys enjoy it as well so I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys